Um, so it's the first time we've ever brought NHL to the Wii, and, uh, and we did so with, with something brand new. It's, uh, we've, got a, we've got a stick here, um, and uh, it's the NHL Slapshot stick, and by putting the Wii remote and the nunchuck in one stick, it's actually really, really accurate, um, and it plays like a real hockey game. Everything you do in the game is based on a real hockey motion. So when you're shooting, you're taking a shot like that, or a slap shot, you're bringing it way back like that, or you're doing a check, it's uh, pushing it out like that. All of the that, That's not legal, though. Oh, no, no, it's, it's just the motion we have to give you. But if you're going to take someone out, you're going to take them out like that. If you look onto the screen onto the left there, you're going to see what we have our, is our peewee mode. Our peewee mode starts you off as, a, as someone that's about 12 years old, and you start in like a backyard kind of rink, and you're playing with three-on-three -three hockey. It's a little bit easier to get into the game. You started as a kid. After you've done that as a kid, you move on to the Bantam Leagues and then into the Junior Leagues, all the way to the, uh, from the AHL, CHL to the NHL. So it's a nice, really long career journey. Uh, a lot of times when, you know, when people have been playing sports games on the Wii, they want to have like a nice long experience, but they also want it to be accessible. So we give you the accessibility by starting you off like that, but we also give you a nice long career mode. Everything you can do in, all of, in our regular hockey products, you can do pretty much everything in the Wii version as well. So what I'm going to do is we've already seen the three-on-three -three version. I'm going to show you exactly what it looks like when we get to the actual NHL. So as you can see, I'm going to pick all the different teams I want. I can do that. Oh, we don't want to do Coyotes. Let's do the Browns. Will all games be come with a stick? Or? Yeah. When you buy the game, it comes with a stick, and you can buy sticks separately as well. So when you set up your game, it's going to ask you how you play the game. Am I using a stick? Because you don't need to have the stick to play the game. You can play with the Wii mode and the nunchuck, and you can also play with just the Wii remote on its own as well. Then when, you, when most people play hockey, a lot of people shoot left but they're right-handed. So we ask you, do you play left or right? Because it changes how the game works. So I'm a righty. Go in here. And we'll load the game. Um, one thing that most people have, have commented on when they see the game, they go, wow, this is a Wii game? Because we've got some pretty good graphic improvements to the game. So it, it looks really sharp. It looks really crisp and clean. And, and, and you'll see that as we get going. And as I take you through the game, I'll start showing you some of the moves, and you'll start seeing how it plays. Uh, you can play four people together as well. Oh, four people with hockey sticks and sticks. you need a big living room. You need lots of room around you. So okay, so we'll just get into gameplay. So I'm gonna take the face off and I'm gonna pull it back just like it normally would. There I won the face off. I can pass. I can shoot. Just like the real motions. Here comes the body check. I if I miss the guy. Mike, listen. Oh, I hope you got that. <laughs> it's always good when you can score on camera. That's really the secret, not the, the blade. It's, it's the thing in between here. Yeah, you know, the, the blade is really, you don't need the blade, but, you know, you wouldn't want to play a hockey game without having a blade on. It just look like, look like, you know, look like a pool cue or something. Um, but the real challenge, the real thing that we've got here is by having these things two this far apart, they both send a signal to the Wii. So the two signals go in there and they triangulate, sort of like GPS almost. It, and it knows exactly when the Wii mode is moving this way and the nunchuck is moving this way, it knows that I'm doing this with the stick. It also knows by having that like this, if I'm hitting the B button and I'm lifting it up, because it's always the same distance apart, it's very, very accurate. So um, it, it's almost like having a, like, a, like a Wii Motion Plus type experience without really needing to put the Wii Motion Plus on it. So. Um, just get back in here, just kind of, you know, just show you some of the more of the moves. Body checking, throwing straight out, and, uh, and, it, and, and, sorry, you do your body check motion going straight out, but if you want to get the puck off the guy and you don't want to hurt him or you don't want to hit him or anything like that, just pulling that trigger and doing that, you can do the poke check off there and you can lift the stick off and take possession of the, of the puck as well. Um, what we've been looking at is the NHL, uh, at the NHL level. Um, and, and in addition to playing, you know, our, our kind of peewee to pro mode where you start out as a kid and make it all the way to the NHL, um, we have lots of different modes of the game. We have uh, mini games that you can play. You can just play a full season. You can just play, just play straight playoffs if you like as well. Um, so there's lots of variety to play. And one feature that we have in the game is if you don't actually, uh, if you're playing with someone that's actually not very good at controlling the player and they're having some challenges, you just take your thumb off of the control stick and it skates for you. It takes over everything for you. All you need to worry about is passing and shooting. So it takes care of the rest. Um, and you can play it with the stick. You can play it with the Wiimote and the nunchuck separately. And you can play it with the Wii remote alone. 
and it'll do all the work for you. You just got to worry about passing and shooting. And uh, I understand you've teamed up with Wayne Gretzky as well. Yeah, that was amazing. Um, Wayne Gretzky is on the cover of our game, and uh, and you can play as Wayne Gretzky as well, and uh, and you can recreate his entire career. So if you want to start, you can start as a 12-year-old Wayne Gretzky and make it all the way in the same journey that he took all the way to the Oilers. Um, but it's your own fantasy, so you can be Wayne with anybody you want. So you can have Wayne and Sidney Crosby on the same team playing at their peak. Um, if you choose to create your own character, you don't want to be Wayne, Wayne will be your coach, and he'll be the one telling you what to work on and giving you rewards and giving you things and telling you things that you should be doing to improve your character. And as I said before, our, our career mode is, is, is very long. You start out with the Pee Wees, you play about seven games of the Pee Wees, you make it to the Bantams, and then you, then you go on to the junior leagues all the way to the NHL. You can be a nice, long, long journey if you want it, or a shorter journey if you want to, because you can jump in at any point in between. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you very much, Thanks. Thanks.